位下龍精英觀眾，大家好。前兩集我哋講咗肺結核病以及點樣預防，以及點樣治療。好消息咧，就係、是、喺紐約市咧，呢、這個治療咧係完全免費，並得到咗紐約市衞生局嘅高度重視。但係，作為中國人嘅我哋，亦都要明白一個道理，就係、是、喺新發現嘅病例中咧，有百分之二十係由我哋中國人社區出嚟嘅。嗱，跟住落嚟咧，我同大家問一下紐約市衞生局布士市局長同埋美洲中華醫學會陳建樂醫生點樣預防肺結核病 ？Well, tuberculosis can be prevented. Tuberculosis is spread through the air, so when somebody has tuberculosis. They should remain isolated and away from other people.、Mm -hmm. But if they are coughing and they are near somebody, they should always remember to cover their mouth and not cough on somebody else. 嗱，肺結核咧就係由空氣中傳染噶。咁咧，如果一個有肺結人誒人咧，當佢咳嗽嗰陣時咧，就將肺結核菌咧就散播喺空氣之中咧，而傳染其他人。咁咧，如果你係有肺結核，菌嘅人咧，咁梗要注意個人衞生習慣啦。咁你咳嗽嗰時咧，就要冚住個口啦。誒，唔好話隨地吐痰啦。隨地吐痰咧，係我哋華人社區見一個係好唔誒健康嘅習慣。咁咁，我哋所以咧一定要注意個人衞生。保健事局長啊，你認為咧點解咧個肺結核係中國人嘅社區係咁集中噶 ？Well, tuberculosis is Really, more prevalent in other countries than it is here in the United States.、Mm -hmm. Many other countries have higher rates and a higher caseload,、mm -hmm. and China has more tuberculosis in the population there than we do here in the United States. So many people are infected with the germ while they're living in China, and it could be many years ago. When they come here, they could become sick、mm -hmm. years later.、Mm -hmm. Other things that promote the spread of TB are living in close quarters. That is, small, crowded apartments, the whole family living together in one small apartment, or spending a lot of time with somebody with active TB in a small and closed space,、mm -hmm. like in an internet cafe, karaoke bar, somewhere where you're spending a lot of time in a small and closed space with somebody with active TB, allows the transmission of this disease. 係啦，肺結核咧喺美國個啊發病率就唔係好高，咁咧其實咧喺中國咧個發病率就係高好多噶。咁我哋通常咧好多誒誒、呃、移民咧喺中國嚟咧啊，依誒當佢嚟美國嗰陣時咧，佢已經喺中國嗰度咧染上咗肺結核，即係接觸咗肺結核菌。雖然未話誒、呃、爆出嚟活動性咧已經係有潛伏性嘅肺結核啦。咁點解我哋中國人咧會咁多肺結核菌咧？咁因為我哋中國人咧。誒多數係大家庭一齊住埋一齊啦，誒好多人同一間屋度啦，咁就可就可以好好容易咧就接觸到長要長期接觸到先有啦。咁另外咧，啊頭先有報告想同我咧，而我嚟咗呢度咧，啊喺誒嗰啲誒誒網吧啊，啊或者卡拉 OK 吧，係係通常喺個誒。誒好誒細嘅房啊，接觸一段時期啊，有肺入菌咧，咁亦都好容易傳染到啦。咁呢啲亦都係啊，我哋要注重嘅。咁你可唔可以同我哋講下日落公園發現嘅咁多例嘅肺結核病情啊 ？Well, we have noticed that in the Sunset Park neighborhood of Brooklyn, within the last couple of years, there has been a concentration of cases of tuberculosis. And we suspect that most of these people know each other and have been spreading tuberculosis recently.、Um, most of the people who have been infected and have the disease are young men who were born in China, and they seem to have connections where they are close friends and spend a lot of time together. Many of them have mentioned spending time in internet cafes, where that's a small space. Or if somebody's coughing with tuberculosis, they can easily spread the disease. Some of the、uh, young men have mentioned that they spend time in karaoke bars. Same thing. It's a small, crowded space where it's easy if somebody's coughing to spread the disease. So we want to bring awareness to the situation in Sunset Park in Brooklyn that there has been more tuberculosis, so that if there are any other people there in the community. Who have the symptoms of tuberculosis, of 
fever, chronic cough, weight loss, that they will go to their doctor to be checked by their doctor for tuberculosis to see if they have the disease. Because if they do have the disease, it's important for them to realize that tuberculosis is treatable and curable. We have the medications, they can come to our TB clinics, the medications are free in our TB clinics, they can be cured from this. When 長時間在一個很窄的房間、房間裏面 Fasua,Kasawa,Pulanghona, 博局長和你分享了紐約市有很多免費的肺結核的診所免費包括免費睇醫生免費包埋藥那他主要的目的是想醫療於團美的肺結核 well, this year we've done many events with the Chinese American Medical Society mm -hmm. and other groups to promote awareness of tuberculosis, particularly within the Chinese American community. Um, I would like to mention one event in particular. This April 18th, we plan to hold a screening in Sunset Park where our public health workers will be available to answer questions, have literature, and we will have the blood test available for TB screening. So anybody who's worried or concerned about tuberculosis can take the test, and then we will uh, proceed with further evaluation if necessary. Hello, 健康教育